right? I don't want to put it. There you go. Wait a minute. It's all right, I got you reaching for the flag. How's that? That's very good, Gene. Let me get it in stereo. Houston, uh, that's beautiful. This has got to be one of the most proud moments of my life, I guarantee you. Let's get a close in one and we'll trade cameras. Houston, I don't know how many of you are aware of this, but this, this flag has flown in the Moker since Apollo 11. And we very proudly to deploy it on the moon to stay for as long as it can in honor of all those people who have worked so hard to put us here and put every other crew here and to make the country, the United States and mankind something different than it was. Roger 17, and uh, presuming to speak on behalf of some of those who work in the Moker, uh, we thank you very much. Jack, right where you were. I'll step to the right. Right there. Yeah, 
that. A big bag there without a ladder hook. That's all it needs. It's just a little bit. There's just enough spring force in it. Okay, Houston, I think you've had all the uh, good words about the limb. We have never uh, flown a better limb. <laughs> I guess that's safe enough to say. <clears throat> the uh, quads look great. No steerables were aimed right at you. Front of the radar is in good shape. It's parked, uh, looks like parallel to Z. Just about perfectly. There's no visible. I'm on the uh, 3 o'clock position, the plus Y. No visible uh, contamination. There's a little bit of discoloration of the plume shields. Uh, below the uh, thrusters. The engine bell never touched the ground. It's about all 15 centimeters off the ground. How's that for coming down? That's what you call OK number three wire, Jack. Hey, we never heard what our landing parameters were. Don't worry we're about that here later. Now that we're here. Oh, but they always, they always give them to us in the simulator. Bob, judging from what I see on my clock, we're not but about five minutes behind. Uh, that agrees more or less with the way we read it. Uh, Gene had a little forward uh, motion, as I think you heard his call, and that shows up in the uh, forward foot pad at any rate, or did. It looks like he may have hit tail first a little bit. Uh, that's embedded... Uh, to the full pad depth. I see no, oh, Mike, George, Gene, you may have had it first. I think you stroked that thing. Stroke what? The rear, uh, the rear uh, landing gear. We can measure it and find out. I'll take a picture of it. May have stroked it. The mylar, the lower orange mylar is uh, folded a little bit. Uh, Roger, there's words floating around down here about typical Navy landings, but I'm not sure whether we believe it or not. Well, he, he caught his tail hook. Hey, Bob. That's the best way. That's uh, Just behind the lamb in that fairly fresh crater, I picked up a example of the kind of Gabbro I was talking about and I'll uh, stick it in the big bag, except the big bag's disappeared. Okay, I gotta give you a reading, Bob, if you're ready. Ready. You put the big bag up. Six, seven, zero, 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 three, one, zero, one. That's six, seven, zero, 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 three, one, zero, one. Okay, we copy that. Jack, I put that there to hold the uh, SRC dock. All right, I just put a sample in it. It's in the bottom of the bag. It's about uh, eight by five centimeters uh, by three centimeters, uh, slightly tabular. Okay, we copy that from the big bag. Yes, sir. Okay. Okay, Bob, I'm Mark on gravity. Copy that. And the light's flashing. Copy that. Uh, I gotta tell you, Bob, I haven't done everything there is to do in the Navy, but the floor net flag has gotta be the most proud thing I'll ever do in my life. If you could see you and you could see it, from where we are, I know you'd feel the same way. No, Roger on that, Gino. <laughs> God, he's pretty up there. God, you're pretty up there over the South Massif. Beautiful. Hope nobody saw that. Beautiful. Oh, they were watching me. <laughs> Those things. Okay. You aren't doing anything with a gravimeter on here, I hope. No, it's on the deck. Okay. Okay, you might That's grab me a frame gun when you put it on there, Jack. Too late, Bob. Okay. I'll get that later. We'll get it later. No hurry. Okay. Uh, 
can. I'm like, figure out how to get this off. You gotta educate us again. We may not remember those. Oops. Ah, the step is in hand. Uh, Roger on that. I'll give you a temperature, see whether it fits. I bet it does. Come on, lock, baby. Okay, it's on. Copy that. Lock. Sure, Roger. Okay. Bob, here's the temperature for you. 40 